All right. Good morning, guys. It's about to be 9.30 a.m. Currently, I have sent out this trade out here, right here in Pips Nation VIP channel, to where I send out signals. Currently, we are in no drawdown. New York session's about to open in literally one minute. So I'm expecting this to just overall break down on all different time frames. I have here the two hour and then I have here the 30 minute. So I'm expecting a very profitable session. And then right after this, um, I might go downstairs, grab something to eat and go work out. But follow me on today's live trading session. Signals breaking down so nicely. It's about to hit its final TP, which will be 200 points in about, you know, let's say, 20 minutes you know it's pretty crazy um but it's about to hit its final tp um basically what i do now is just copy this right here uh control copy and then paste it on pips nation that we hit our final tp tb3 hit 2000 pips which is 200 points but before i write it let's just confirm that it hits so it just hit tp let me update the whole group chat tp3 2,000 points, which is, uh, I'm sorry, 2,000 pips, which is 200 points. Send, uh, that's an easy, easy trade for today. But let's start off with saying what we did this morning. This morning we took a uh, US 30 for a sell due to the fact that the market was already coming down on the higher time frames. If we look at the one hour, we see that the market was coming down, tried to go up, came down, tried to go up again, ultimately failed and then came back down. So this is where we took this position where we won 200 points. I also send out this position live on Pips Nation. It's a free Telegram group chat. You guys could click the link up here, down there. I have no idea. Click the link and join the free Telegram. But I send out the signal at 8.16 a.m about an hour before the New York session opened due to the fact that I already saw the market breaking towards the bottom. And then pretty much we hit our full, um, we hit our last TP, which was 200 points. And I just put here 2000 pips so people could understand in a much better way. When you have a great day like this, you just look forward to your day. Like as a trader, you just look mad forward to your day. So I'm super excited. I think tonight me and Jess are going out with John and Tiff. John, he's one of the signal providers for Pips Nation, so it's very cool that you guys will see him today. Yo, Jess, are you ready? So Jess took her time today to get ready, so that's why she wasn't part of the video, but she, she, she's locking in for the gym. She's locking in for the gym. <laughs> I'm alive now. The party is here. The cinnamon challenge, yo. Uh, oh, fuck! Oh, okay. You're supposed to put water in your mouth first, and then you put it. We are one weird, weird couple. Right there? Nah, that's all you. Can you take it off both of you? Yeah. We just put the boxing gloves and we go at it. Yeah, where's the boxing gloves? We have them right here, look! Yeah? Don't <laughs> the market on one of my clients accounts so something that I'm involved in is called private equity management let's say that you don't have a hundred K you don't have 200 K to trade with you could go to someone that does have that money but you know doesn't know what to do with the money there's so many people that have so much money that don't know what to do with it and you could tell them hey I will grow your money 8 12 16 percent a month and you charge them 30 40 percent of the profits depending on what they're comfortable giving you and it's a great way to make money in this industry without having to go through a prop firm or without having to raise your own capital also um don't trade and drive 
And for anyone right now in the video saying, Lewis, why do you hate BMW so much? This is another reason. Check this out. I go here. It doesn't shut the fuck up. That's why I hate it. I like the cars where you take off your seatbelt and it just stays quiet. It's for your safety. <laughs> A real man flies out the window. Right. But we are late, so I gotta hurry up now. He has a little memory loss. It's hot as fuck today. I got my wallet. Do you wanna do Caesar salad instead of roasted vegetables? Yeah. Okay. And what did you order? Um, churrasco, yeah. which is pure steak with double fries. Double and fries. Zero Coke. Coke Zero. Coke Zero, yes. Great. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Yeah. How much Coke do you want? Zero. <laughs> zero Coke. Alright, so you um, said. Okay, so I am just with the mess because I am sometimes the mess here. And um, we love coming to this restaurant, it's really good. We love the skirt steak. If you guys didn't know, Louis's favorite food is skirt steak and french fries. He said that once I master how to do truffle fries, he'll marry me. We'll, we'll get there eventually. And <laughs> Things are not looking I mean, good. I mean, that's pretty much it. What do you have to say about me and our favorite restaurant? Oh, the so, bread is good here too. He loves bread, so I call him Don Pan. Like, he has to have bread. So, life, you know, life... Life is like a sandwich. <laughs> bread comes first. True. Right? So, as far as for this, I feel like after, I might need a psychologist, and the psychologist will need a psychologist himself. <laughs> after what this? I'm kidding. No, but uh, it's really cool because we're in, we're involved in two different industries. You're involved in e-commerce. I'm involved in trading. So your industry feeds mine really well because you teach me a lot about marketing, sales funnels, um, website development, 3D development for web point uh, web 3.0 looks. So you really cater to my business my business doesn't really cater to yours because mine's is just all trading but it's really cool how we work in two different industries but we try to merge them together to work together as much as possible which i think my like he mentioned my business like doing like marketing and e-commerce it really helps him out so yeah i think absolutely good what you said <laughs> idiot and i call him dumbo by the way because he has flying ears <laughs> but uh yeah we came in there to try to throw some pictures for some content and she's like no nah, you can't throw pictures here and this and that um by the way it's 320 market's about to close like in 40 minutes so i'm gonna close out all my positions and i'm done for the day pretty much oh the salt oh no <laughs> Look at what you did to the car, Jess. Yeah. The energy is back, baby. What's in that drink? What's in that drink? Tequila with vodka and soda. I'm kidding. And C4. <laughs> uh, Dumbo. <laughs> really can't hear anything on this. This reminds me when I used to work at Jack in the Box. Walk into Jack in the Box, how can I take your order today? And then at the end, we'll be like, Would you like to add an Oreo shake today? And they'll be like, No, ma'am. I'll be like, Okay, have a beautiful day. <laughs> we are about to get on a call. We're going to put My Wi Fi is so slow. And we're about to plan out some courses that we're working on. And yeah, exciting stuff coming soon. Lewis doesn't seem that happy. Because the fucking Wi Fi and shit. Levantate, mijo, so. levantate. <laughs> hey. This shit crazy. This shit feel like. Hitting the buzzer beater or something. Championship game. Dream team. Oh. Here's to a successful video prank today. <laughs> Cheers to 2022. Solo, solo, chuck it, chuck it. 
chug it. Oh, you want me to chug it? Chug oh, relax. Chug it, chug it. Cheers to all your successful calls today. Solo, solo. Ah, perro. That's it? Yeah, perro. What John follow? Yeah, oh, I'm oh, oh, My turn, my turn, my turn. Oh. Oh, shit, she about that? She about that? That's going on. Eee. I'm here to relax. Which one of you is next? Nah, nah, there's still some in there, girl. Go, go, John. Oh, John there's wants to record himself. Hey, you're next. You're next. You're next. Yay! That's off camera. John, let's Can go. Can Tim follow? Can Tim follow? Tim follow. Can John follow? Go ahead. After the photo shoot. You go. You go. Can John uh, yeah, follow? After the photo shoot. Are you giving 101 about the thing in here? Yep. Come on, John. Got it. Got it. I don't appreciate you taking photos. Man, look at this guy. We have a whole... Hey, you had a whole production here, but he's still gonna go with that thing. He's still gonna go with that thing. We have the Fast and the Furious production like this. Baby, 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 She's like, I want to eat. Instagram eats first, homie. Oh, no, honey. I eat first. Wow, these tacos. I eat first. <laughs> Ugh. And where's my rice? <laughs> day all day, every day. Yes. Cheers to the withdrawal. Cheers to the discharge. <laughs> <laughs> to the discharge. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to figure out what are we laughing at. No current trades open. Um, we're gonna wait till tomorrow. Um, if I wake up at 8:30, I will look to take some trades. If I don't, then fuck it. It's life. You know, you trade, you live. The whole point of trading is for financial freedom. So. Go get that freedom. So it's 1.30, 1.40 a.m. and that basically concludes my day. Usually right now I would get on and look at the London session, but I am a little bit tipsy. So i rather not do that. I'd rather just go to sleep so I could have a good six to seven hours of sleep and wake up at eight. You know, let's face it, 8.30. <laughs> Wake up at 8.30 and get ready for the New York trading session. I'm pretty much done trading for the week due to the fact that I've had amazing results today and yesterday. But I always like waking up, looking at the market and seeing new opportunities or new things that the market presents itself so I can keep advancing in terms of getting better and better and better and better. So I leave this call or I leave this message with work works if you put in the work it would eventually work out for you so that's what you guys should be doing each and every single day that's lewis out good night guys mm -hmm.